Good morning, good evening, good day, crypto world. It is 11.50 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, 9.14, 2019. You've got the market right now doing okay. 10,305.56 for Bitcoin. And when you look at the altcoins, they're starting to cook up. Uh, Ethereum, 187.32, up 3.26%. XRP, 26, up 2.95%. Not anything like surging, surging, but boy, when you look over at the weekly graph over to the right, you can see that the market is turning up a little bit for the alts. And Bitcoin is not doing too bad when you think about what it's been doing. So coming up with a few things happening in the near future, you can see how this could be very beneficial. Um, now, speaking of beneficial, you've got the Apollo and ADF partnership announced on June 13th, 2019, is now three months old. <laughs> and that is good. When you think about the three months that the, they have been working together and they're in Africa pursuing the National Currency Initiative through the impoverished countries with hyperinflation, that's news and that's building. Now, when you look at their wallet and network production, you've got DEX coming soon. And the code for DEX, as you can look at here, you can see that the compare is no longer, these are no longer open. Everything has been merged. They may just open it, you know, in the next week or so to just finalize a few things, but I doubt it. I think you're gonna see a little tiny action, but most everything is set. They have a new video coming out, um, which for the marketing team of Apollo to show the decks with atomic swaps in action. And then it's due this quarter, and where there's two weeks left of this quarter. Um, so it's very exciting times for Apollo, along with sharding. And we'll get into a little bit more than that. But here is a, this one here. I love this. A title. Google and Amex to partner with Ripple when the regulation on crypto becomes clear. Okay, number one is right there. You can say, well, wait a minute. They're waiting for crypto regulation. That could be how long, whatever. But the, the what they should have done here is down here, um, the site should have basically just said that things are working and there are unconfirmed reports uh, that are making rounds in the tech circles that purport that Google and Ripple are already cooperating in building a low-cost super fast payment platform and that is something that you probably will hear is the case because um, you got to think about utility and Brad Garlinghouse pushes it a lot and the thing is when you have the products and the assets that have the utility use, you are going to see those coins in the future be the ones that are out there that are being used. And of course, the value is going up. Why? Because they're usable. Okay, the ones that are fluff, forget them. Ongoing EOS, oh, the, this one here, the exploit allows attacker to gain 30,000 EOS. <laughs> Using the REX, which is a resource exchange for RAM and CPU, this dude, or dude S, um, sure the blocks were filled with their transactions to continuously win on the gambling DApp EOS play. This resulted in the EOS IO network freezing as thousands of EOSs were fed to the attacker's wallet. Dun 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 dun. dun. On the hacker note, we also have hacked Florida Auto Shop refuses to fork out 100,000 Bitcoin ransom. Good. But when you look at what the idiot who was doing this to this uh, business did, basically stealing and locking up his domain, changing the registration of the domain, and even doing research on the business to know what the guy made approximately in his tax filings um, and more. So basically saying that since you made about a $400,000 last year, you can afford this 10 BC or 10 BTC to let me give you back your business stuff. <laughs> so crap. Now speaking of utility and Brad Garlinghouse, you've got Brad had his CNN interview and very good too very good two parts fantastic talks about the control of xrp and manipulation of the price well guess what as he points out 
Ripple can't control the price of XRP any more than whales can't control the price of Bitcoin. Nobody's in the position to manipulate XRP prices. Very true. When you look at what they're paying out to Jeb, and Jeb cashes out every day, and the price is going up, you see going up 3%. It doesn't affect it. People would say, well, yo, it would have gone up a little bit more. Yeah, it does. But in the big picture, it's always going to go. It's going to go on its adventure. You're not going to have the situation where a guy is cashing out some. It's going to knock down the coin totally. No, it's going to be something where this is it. Buy, sell is all part of investments. Buy, sell. Sell for profit. Ding dong. Now, getting into the, here we go here. Utility. Try That'll be the, the piece for my video today. Utility. Tron's network now harbors 577 dApps. Forget ju you know, this Justin Sun's issues and all that. You got to understand that Tron has the ability with everything that it has built into its network to have a fantastic entertainment network. And it's going to happen. Um, the dApps, 577 dApps on their network. More and more that they're doing, it's going to turn out to be a nice one. Is the value of that coin going to surge way high? I don't think so. But will it gain profits? Yes. Uh, crypto milestone, new decentralized. Uh, this is what I love. New decentralized fiat to crypto gateway launches on the Ethereum blockchain for Visa and MasterCard users. Not truly decentralized, but good to have fiat to crypto on there. And when you look at it, be your first crypto or buy your first crypto today. Coin direct. Visa, Kyber Swap, not bad. No KYC when you go for small amounts. <laughs> Look at that down here if you see it. K by K by Kyber Swap, I'm just laughing too much. Kyber Swap expects a new platform to spur adoption by eliminating complex KYC complex KYC for small amounts and enabling the crypto curious. People, I like to see what their small amount is. Um, but there, and another thing too, decentralized. When you say decentralized, it cannot have a centralized piece in it, and these businesses make it that way. Now you're getting. Speaking of decentralized, speaking of utility, you've got the Apollo currency APL ready to rock. And why do I say that? The DEX coming. It's coming. It's the utility. The thing about sharding that Apollo has done, which is historic, makes the network the most advanced and efficient. That is the bomb, correct? It is. When you have the network that, that is the fastest, the most private, and then you have the most efficient, that is the bomb. But in the utility aspect for what daily users will be using and being enthusiastic with because they can feel it, touch it. Enjoy it. DEX with atomic swaps coming for Apollo. And that is going to spur the price upwards. I am not a soothsayer, but I'll tell you one thing. When you have something, I feel like I'm preaching on, on the church choir, not the church choir, but on the uh, altar. Uh, but anyway, and we'll get the choir in the background going. The thing about this is that when you have the assets and the products and they're working, and you have the utility aspect. Ding dong. The DEX video showing in action with atomic swaps coming shortly. Can't wait to post it. That is going to be all over Twitter. That's going to go crazy. Um, and the thing about that, that's just anticipation more. But the day that Apollo announces it is released, at that point, Anybody can buy Apollo easily in their wallet. And that is the bomb. You can open up your wallet. The wallet, when you go to the website, the link is down below. The wallet tab up there, second one over, platform wallets. You have all that available to you to then exchange out to your bank using the Paxos stablecoin or send to the spend card, which lets you take and put Paxos to that and the spend card you have the app in the play store in the android store 
So I should say the, yeah, that was, whatever, Apple Android. Now when you have that availability, there is your utility. And not only that, you have private messaging, data storage with timestamp. You have a marketplace to spend your policy on delivered to your door. You have forging to earn passive income. Have I mesmerized you yet with that background and all those features? Apollo is the bomb of features, and they are the news, no doubt about that. Coming up shortly with Atomic Swaps, Daniel, one of the devs for Apollo in the Ukraine, used to head First Bridge as a CEO, basically made a statement, and this was in my last video or two, that they he apologizes for the delay, but there was a video coming of local test of the full DEX functionality with Atomic Swaps. We are sweeping through final test and bug fixes, and essentially most of the text is implemented, is already implemented from past dev. When you, that code I showed you on GitHub, that is implemented, that is produced. So, and like he says, please consider that we just released full on sharding, and it has been followed by atomic swaps, probably a, one of the first on the market. They are the only way to have a truly decentralized exchange without them an exchange is forced to have a central wallet as there is no direct instant p2p deal closure we have a very squeezed time frame and we are looking forward to hit the next big milestone in the coming weeks so that is going to be awesome with their phds and their ai experience doing dex sc engine and dag coming up they have a scientific background and it's amazing with aerospace, cybersecurity, performance computing. Apollo's got the best devs in the world. Why do I say that? I'm not just saying that now. They do. They did sharding for the first time ever on a database blockchain. Yeah, first time ever. They got the best. They did the updater, which prevents forks. Can I say that one more time? Pre prevents forks. Then you have, ooh, let's go back there fast. Wasn't looking what I was doing there. You've got the 24 7 bits that you can use your Apollos to pay. You have a small Antilly exchange available. It's cool for, I think it's in New Zealand uh, that you can, they have that. That's cool. Every little bit helps. But there's a new exchange that they're announcing soon. Steve said a top tap. Dex development nearing completion. Ding dong. New wallet. Uh, forging, I'm getting a lot of questions on forging. They're working on the forging fixes, and that'll be taken care of soon. Um, Apollo speaks on bit active blockchain. Now, when you go into this quickly with a decentralized exchange, can't be more excited for it besides having the barbecue today. It's Sunday and it'll round for most of the world. Um, when you're going out and maybe you're having a barbecue, think about the possibilities of Apollo. It is the bomb. They have everything ready to rock. They've aligned it. And that's the thing. When this video first came out, this was talking about sharding was activating sharded sharding is activated it is running on apollo's network you have sub second speeds coming and multi or I should say multi million TPS coming um, and then you have all these features I just described to you Apollo is innovating like no other like no other and this is why I've been doing it daily for the most part since 2018 in April 2018 Apollo has been building it and they will come and the thing about the pricing it's affordable right now for so many people uh, on BitMart and IDAX Pro. I'm not your financial advisor, but when you look at the facts and you do your own research, when you have them over in Africa, this this is Willie Bestoff and Steve in Africa working with the ADF as a partnership to take care of business. The first time that Apollo does a national currency in one of the hyperinflation countries in Africa or elsewhere in the world, it's going to be huge for the Apollo community. Anybody holding Apollo coins, 
you are going to be so happy you have them. Apollo is going to rock Africa. They're going to rock the crypto world with everything being disclosed. When they market sharding and DEX, atomic swaps, and more, and they put it all together, and they get it out there massively with all over. And, of course, you got the Twitter people that are going crazy. Okay, the Apollo nuts on Twitter, going crazy. Keep it up. The thing you got to think about, packing it all together, getting it ready. It's coming all together. It's going to be a rush to watch it develop. And that's 2019. Wait till 2020. It's time for Apollo to rock. They're going to be the news, and I can't wait to break it with Dex. Everybody, enjoy your Sunday. It is 9-15-2019. We are halfway through the last month of the quarter. This is going to be exciting.